Hi, I'm Ordana from boysandgirlshairstyles.com. Today I have Britton with me and we are going to cut off her hair. Um, I talked to her mom and what she wants is just a short um, A-line and we're going to stack this back. Um, and a good reason to do this is she just has thinner hair. Um, when they're little, just keep it cut short and that will really thicken the hair up. Um, First off, I'm just going to put her head straight down. Just have them put their chin to the chest. And like I said, we're going to go pretty short here in the back. So I'm going to just come down here at the nape area. And you can decide, you know, the length of, you know, that you want, where you want that to start. Okay, put your head down. There you go. Okay, and then I just hold it with my scissors and come in here, or with my comb, come in here with my scissors and go that way. Okay, when I get to this side, you're going to want to tilt the head up a little bit. If you leave it down and you keep cutting, when you lift up, it's going to go short. So, just keep it lifted just a little bit and tilt it. And then I'm going to angle my fingers down a little bit. Okay, and then I'm going to tilt that head a little bit more. I'm going to angle my fingers. Same thing. Okay, see, this is about where I want my length. Um, and then after, after I dry it, if I want to take this back up a little bit more, we can, but I'm just going to go this short for now. So the first thing that you're wanting to do is get this, okay, put your head all the way down, there you go, is just get this main length on the bottom. Okay, so we're at the side length. So I'm going to lift our head a little bit. Okay, and tilt it to the other side. Okay, I'm going to tilt it this way. Okay, start angling down. Angle your fingers down. check both sides. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to cut the back and how I like to stack hair. Some people like to start up here in the crown area and I like to start at the nape and the reason being is because I can determine how stacked I want the haircut and I'll show you right now. Way I like to do that. So just take this section and pull that up. Oh, sorry. Okay. I'm going to take a section here in this middle. Okay, so if you want it pretty stacked, you're going to keep your fingers up high. If you don't want it as stacked, you're going to drop your fingers. See how that stack will be this way? If you want it more stacked, you're going to lift the fingers. So I'm going to stack it about that, that tight. Okay, and then you can drop that. And then I'm going to bring this next section over, and I'm going to connect that with the guide point, the guide line right there, which is the other hair that I've just cut. Okay, and then this part I'm going to hold all the way back. So after you cut that, it can it's going to come longer on the sides. And she has natural curl, um, so you can kind of see that right there. So once we style it, I'm just going to take the flat iron to that a little bit. Okay, so just hold those back. And take the sides back with that also. Okay, then you can just comb that out. Okay, now I'm going to take another section. Okay, I'm going to take that middle section 
and you can see, see that hair underneath that's cut and this is long. So I'm just going to grab those and put that together. And again, just make sure your fingers go the angle that you want it. If you want, don't want it stacked, come this way. If you want it more stacked, go up. So I'm kind of going to come in between those two. Okay, then take this hair, connect it with the middle part. Okay, and then these sides, again, take them all the way back. So when they fall, they can fall long, longer. Okay, just keep following that guideline, <coughs> excuse me, around the head. The reason I love um, when little girls cut their hair off when they're little and it's thin, it just makes it look so much thicker. Then it seems like, you know, all that baby hair gets cut off and you start growing in more hair. It just thickens it up really good. Okay, now I'm going to drop the rest of that down. Just going to wet it down a tiny bit. Sorry. Combs, combs, combs. Okay, then I'm going to take all of this and I'm going to hold it out. I'm going to cut up this way. And then what I want to do is from here up, I want to do a 90 degree angle, which is straight out from the head. So just bring that up. So that's going to be that top layer that comes into that stack. Okay, then I'm going to hold it out this way. Come up. Just follow that guideline. Okay, now take this hair back, come up on the sides, okay, now you can just comb that down, okay, now just come over here, take this side, again, 90 degree angle, from the head. Okay, hold this all the way back. Still do the 90. Okay. So now, I'm just going to kind of comb that down. You can see how that's kind of stacked. Okay, now for the front. I want it to kind of fall along here. So what I'm going to do is take this whole top and I want to angle it. So I want to take from this layer up to this top. So I'm going to angle my fingers up this way. Okay, so angle it up. And the reason being is, so when it falls, it's a little bit longer. If you want more layering in the front, you can just cut it straight across. Okay, and then I like to pull both sides just straight up. Okay, and she parts there. Now, to connect these sides, because she is going to have long and short hair. I'm going to take a little section in front of her ear and behind, and I'm just going to hold that straight out. You, you can see that corner. I want to take that off so it takes the bulk from her ear right here and the side away. Okay, so just take that section in back and in front of her ear and just hold it straight out. And there's that corner. You can just take that corner off there. Okay, now what I'm going to do is another video on her style and how to style it. So just check that one out. And that's the cut with the short stack for a little girl.